Hi guys, Brendan from Advanced Radio here. Today I'll be going through a quick instructional video on how to set up the regulation and battery monitoring in your new Smartbus RS system. Today we'll be using the Xbus version, although this setup will be exactly the same on the Fataba, Spectrum, Gropner and Jetty versions as well. Now ensure you have two batteries plugged in. Today we'll, we are using the excess power range and these are both 6400 milliamp packs at 7.4 volts. These two batteries are actually Lions and will allow us to regulate down to 7.2 or 7.4 volts. So ensure that both batteries are plugged in and you've got your color touch screen plugged in as well. Go into the main menu, hit the power button. Here you'll see your battery capacity milliamps. Ensure that this is the milliamp counter is set to the value of one of your packs. So we're using 6400 pack. We'll set this using the positive or the plus. 6400. When using two batteries with the smart bus, we ensure uh, we, we recommend that you use batteries of the same type, so two Lions, LIFO, LIFOs or LIFEs, and of the same capacity. Now we've set our battery capacity to 6400, which is the same as what we're using on our batteries, and we can go down here and set our regulator, where it says servo voltage selector, 7.4 volts. We can either select 6 volts or 7.4 volts here. We'll regulate down to 6 volts. The Smartbus RS has an onboard regulator and will actually go away and do it automatically. You can see the numbers updating on the screen. That's the regulator regulating down to 6 volts. There we go. We've just set the regulator to 6 volts. Now if we want to regulate back up to 7.4, we push the 7.4 button and hit yes. The screen has now come up to 7.4 volts. When we go back out to our main screen, you'll see two battery voltages, 7.6 on each, and 7.4 volts of your regulator. When using the RS system, if you're using LiPos or Lion batteries, we recommend regulating to 7.4 volts. If you're using LiFe batteries, we recommend regulating to 6 volts. That's all for the setup of the regulator. There'll be more, there'll be more videos coming shortly. Thank you.